I'm Robbie Bolo, now with the other Matthews brother. This one's Mitch. We're gonna have you tell the truth about everything. No, okay. I'm sure Marcus told the truth. Okay. Uh, how's it feel to be back, first of all? It feels good. Um, I got a slow start when I got back. I got hurt when I got back, but um, it's, been a, it's, been, it's been a trial to get back because it's just hard. You know, you're not used to everything that, that happens here. And, but I feel like by now, I, I feel healthy and I feel good. What's been the hardest thing? Just, I think, physical health. Um, I think from freshman year, you're, I mean, you're, more, you're older, you're more mature, and you can get the plays down better. You can get the, like, you know it better. I was here before, so coming back, I already knew what to expect. But physically getting ready was probably the hardest part. Marcus was a wide receiver, now a tight end. Are you going to stay receiver or follow the Matthews tradition of playing tight end? Well, <laughs> I, I would love to say I would love to say receiver. I love the position, and um, I think he's a little bit he's a little bit bigger than I am, so that's why he made the move, and he can he can play both, and that's what they need him for is to maybe even play both because he's athletic enough to do that. And but he's bigger than me, so he'll, he'll, he'll move in and I stay out. Usually when missionaries come home, you talk about how different they look. You come home and your brother looked completely different because he'd put right. on some weight. Right. Yeah, I know. Yeah, I was definitely you know skinnier, and I, I looked at myself in the mirror and said, who is I? I don't even know who that is. That's not even me. But I came home, and he was a lot bigger, and he looked good. And so it's not even what I re remembered him being like. But you know, he worked so hard to be there where he's at, so it's good. He said you got taller on your mission. How much did you grow? I think, well, I get that every single day. Someone says I get taller every single day. So I, I probably did. Over two years, I probably did get a bit taller. And How much do you think? Do you know? Probably, you probably an inch. <laughs> Maybe an inch. So I, was, I think I was 6'5 before, now I'm 6'6. Six, six, so. Are you still growing? I hope I'm done. But I don't, I don't know. I hope I'm done. I, I don't know. I'm a 6'10 receiver would be pretty formidable, I think. I think by that point, I think they might have me play, ba play some basketball instead. Coach Rose might be not going to mind where to play me, have, have me play basketball instead. So... Hey, we'll have he and Bronco do the gauntlet you guys did today, and the winner gets to have you on the team Perfect. then. Yep, that's how, that's how it should be. So, I mean, I, I think the height I'm at, it, it gives me an advantage, and I love being the height I am. I just need to remain, remain healthy, and um, I can you know, go up and get the ball over people, and the height helps and everything, so I like it. Now, your brother did something. My sister's on a mission right now, comes home this weekend. I got married while she was gone. Marcus got married while you were gone. <laughs> Just prepare me for you know what my sister's gonna say to me this weekend. Were you okay with the fact that he went and got married while you were gone? <laughs> so yeah, no, I was definitely. I mean, the funny thing is though, I'm pretty sure he had a girlfriend. He had the girl that he married, Hayden. She uh, was dating her for a while, and I could tell that he was waiting to marry her before I got home because he he wanted me to approve before he got before he uh, married her. And so when when I got back and and he was, I knew he I knew he loved her. I knew he wanted to get married with her and everything. And he wanted me to approve, and I definitely did. So I'm glad he did. Perfect timing. All right, good. As long as you approve, because yeah. it's too late. You know, when you come right, home and you yeah, don't approve, yeah. it's too late. Uh, what are you trying to improve personally in fall camp as you get ready for the season opener? I just think well, our defense is very, very good. We have a very good defense, a lot of returning starters, and they're very good. So I, I just think, um, I mean, it's, as you know, football is about winning. I just need to keep that competitive drive. That's a big thing on this team is we have a very competitive team. I just need to win, catch the ball, and make sure that, you know, I'm not soft because these guys are they're coming for you. And so as long as I'm – tough catching the ball and I'm getting first downs and I'm happy with that. Okay, we look forward to seeing you. Okay, thank you so much.